everybody, this is Randy Santel, Atlas, and I am very, very excited tonight. I'm going for overall win number 992, and I am back in the Westport area of Kansas City, Missouri. We've got lots of people here, which is much appreciated. I am here at Chicken Waffle. Dennis and Sarah are the owners. Dennis, his brother Adam, actually owns Jerusalem Cafe, where I was two days ago. But I'm here at Chicken Waffle, helping them kick off. I'm the first person to attempt their brand new chicken or check out Chicken and Waffles Challenge. Now, I am very, very excited for all this, and this is not it. I've got dessert after I finish all this as well. All four of the signature waffles, they've got three chicken tenders, and then they've got Hong Kong style bubble waffles, which have more egg in them than traditional waffles that we usually have here in the States. Right here, we've got their spicy chick, which is Sarah's favorite. It's got a crispy buttermilk chicken drenched in their homemade sriracha infused maple sauce topped with fresh jalapenos and chives. Then over here, we've got their chicken maple. It's got classic buttermilk chicken topped with maple syrup and chives. Then over here, we've got their Asian chili. It's got Thai-inspired Asian chili sauce drenched over crispy chicken with toasted sesame and pickles. And then these pickles are good. They're on these fries over here too. I've already had some. Over here, we've got their Canadian buffalo. It's got medium heat buffalo sauce cooled down with ranch and then topped with blue cheese drizzled with maple, but we didn't go with blue cheese. I think we went with shredded mixed cheese, but I am scared about what I've got over here. They've got a whole bunch of loaded fries on their menu, but this is a newer one that's not even on the actual menu yet. It is their Nashville hot chicken loaded fries. I tried the sauce, it is spicy, so we're probably gonna work on these later on. And while I'm doing that, this is not part of the challenge, but they did give me one of their uh, signature strawberry frozen lemonade. So, and then after this, I won't tell it just yet, but we've got dessert to finish as well. But I've got one hour to finish everything here. If I fail, it's gonna be $60. But if I win, I'll get my meal free. I will get a sweet chicken waffle t-shirt and I'll have my name and photo. I'll be the first winner up on the wall of fame. Let's get this challenge started. All right, I don't think I've had just chicken and waffles as part of a food challenge ever. So big thank you to the owners, Dennis and Sarah. Sarah actually created pretty much most of the menu while she was pregnant with their now daughter, Mia, who is two. I've got one hour to feast on all this. Let's shut up and eat. One, two, three. Eat. Boom. All right, I'm gonna start with some of this chicken and maple. I was gonna eat just like a burrito, but they added a lot of syrup and it's a little bit soggy, so I think I'm gonna be able to be more efficient just eating it by itself. Dennis did say these are Hong Kong style waffles and there's not many places around Kansas City where you'll find these kind of waffles with chicken and waffles, so let's have one. Oh yeah. All right, done with the first one. This one is, I think, the Asian one. So I'm gonna do this one next. Four minutes, 45 seconds in. Waffle number two. Yeah. 
I can't say that I taste there's more egg in it or anything like that, but I like the texture in general of the bubble waffle. The syrup's not to use, it's to chug at the end. Super Trooper style. I'm gonna do the Canadian buffalo uh, next. Thankfully, they didn't add uh, blue cheese. They put on like a, a shredded mixed cheese. And then there's ranch on top. That is good too. I like this, uh, the spice level of the buffalo sauce. I wanted Jerusalem Cafe, so I got to win tonight here. Eleven minutes, ten seconds. Plus, I gotta win the night so I don't throw off my plans for win number a thousand coming up. All right, we're done with the chicken for that one. Waffle number three. some buffalo sauce that dripped down onto this waffle with the syrup, it's pretty good. Good mix of flavor. Ooh. Definitely getting my fill of chicken tonight. And waffle. Shout out to Sarah for picking some good stuff on the menu and then they chose these four for me. But Sarah was craving chicken and waffles her entire pregnancy with their now uh, two-year-old daughter Mia. And then they ended up opening a restaurant. So let's finish this and then move on to these scary Nashville hot chicken fries. Do you just like ladle sugar into here? Or? It is sweet. It's very good though. It's helping to cut the fried chicken and everything. All right, other than the chicken on these fries, I'm done with all the chicken as part of the signature dishes. Now we've got waffle number four. Dennis said it might get sticky tonight, and he was right. I think this is like a pound of their Nashville hot chicken fries, but I don't think we need the syrup anymore. I don't know why I asked for it. I never used it, but uh, hopefully this sauce doesn't get me. Let's do it. Where there's a well, there's a way. Okay, that sauce is hot, but it's not as bad as the Hellfire stuff up in Omaha. That stuff up in Omaha at Angus was rough. Oh, okay, I'm getting full, but I'll get it. We'll be good, I just need a minute. I was feeling rough today, but then I did an hour and a half bike ride and I was feeling all better. And now I'm feeling rough because of these. 
There's jalapenos too, but we're gonna get it. We got Brenda in the crowd saying this stuff isn't that hot, so now I have to, yeah, whatever. She's been to three events while I've been in Kansas City, so she can say whatever she wants and be appreciated. Once we have this in a cup, we are gold. If you don't want to come down just to eat here at Chicken Waffle, go out in Westport, any kind of big night. It's always fun here. Back when I lived in Kansas City, I'd probably have been here over 100 times to go out. But uh, on major nights, they're open until 3 a.m. So have fun and then come here and get some food. You won't be the only one. All right, I've been talking long enough. Let's do this. that. Can I bring Katina too? Yeah. Then all right. It's always a good reason to come to Kansas City. There is, I think, like a half a cup of Nashville hot chicken sauce on this, so cut me a break. I am really hoping the dessert's not that big. I have not seen it yet. After this bite, we're basically there. Let me contemplate my existence. Oh, this is saving me. I'm glad I have this. It's not required, but I'm finishing it. Just gonna get the spicy scraps. Oh, I can feel it burning down my esophagus, but we are done. Woo! Time for dessert. Oh, shit. This is like that dang challenge in uh, Lakewood Ranch where they didn't show me the dessert beforehand and then it came out massive. We got plenty of time, let's get it down. It is their churro dessert uh, waffle. There's, I think, vanilla ice cream. There is cinnamon toast crunch, and then what else? Drizzled icing, more sugar. Let's do it. Cinnamon Toast Crunch in a while, so this is good. They did say this is their number one selling dessert as well. It's a lot harder to do food challenges every day when you digest your food. I am trying to hurry, I'm also trying to not get sick. I think when you order food, you can get it either in a waffle or in a cone. Technically, this is a waffle cone. Ah, 40 minutes and 30 seconds, we got it. Still got tons of time. We got some icing uh, caked on down here. We're gonna get that too. Ah! That was a delicious chicken or check out chicken and waffles challenge here at Chicken Waffle in the Westport area of Kansas City, Missouri. I am gonna chug this, even though it wasn't required, just uh, since I started with it. Ah, there you go for anybody that wants me to do that. I've gotta say, I don't really know what my favorite was. 
I enjoyed the hot chick. I also enjoyed the Canadian uh, buffalo. Uh, I love the buffalo sauce mixed in with the syrup on the waffle. But all four of those were great. There were four other options too. So if you want to try this challenge, you get to pick which four you want. You get to pick the fries that you want, the loaded fries. I think there were a, there were more options than just what I had today. I'm going to get my $60 chicken and waffles meal for free. I am going to get a sweet t-shirt that's got their logo on the front. Chicken waffle here in Kansas City. So big thank you to the owners Dennis and Sarah and their family and everybody here with Chicken Waffle for uh, having me in to help kick off the challenge and get the first win. I'm going to be in Topeka, Kansas tomorrow doing a pizza challenge, but it was overall win number 992. Thank you guys for watching.